lakini yore kwa Gutam 7 ana ujumbe hapa. Ana ujumbe. Mm. Naam. E, e, Rais wa Uganda Yoweri Kaguta Museven mtazamaji wa TBC leo alitembelea ubalozi wa Tanzania pale Kampala nchini Uganda. Ilikuwa ni asubuhi kama saa hivi na alifikisha ujumbe na salamu zake za pole kwa Tanzania alipotembea katika ubalozi wa Tanzania pale nchini Uganda. Excellency Ambassador of Tanzania, the Dean of the Diplomatic Corps, the Honorable Minister of Foreign Affairs, and the people of Tanzania who are now mourning when I, I left the house, the morning I was in the stadium in Dodoma, because I've been watching what has been going on. What I wrote in the book here is that two weeks ago, I had written to His Excellency Magufuri a letter about the pipeline. This was because today, 22nd of March, was supposed to be the signing day for the tri tripartite between uh, Uganda, Tanzania, and the Total Company. The sign you are supposed to be in Entebbe today, 22nd. In the letter, I had jokingly written that today would be a, a double victory day because about 42 years ago, yesterday, 21st of March, the Tanzanian People's Defense Forces, together with our freedom fighters, with, my, with me present, had defeated the army of Idi Amin in their counterattack against the town of Mbarara at a place called Rugando, 12 miles from Mbarara on the Kabari Road. So I was joking, see that I was saying that today would be a double victory, a, a, a day for double victory for military and political uh, and economic. Little did I know that today I will be here signing a condolences book. This is so sad, so unexpected, it's really However, as I wrote in the book, we the freedom fighters have long learned how to deal with such challenges. Uh, the death of Mondlane, 1969, the death of, of Samora Macher, the death of Agustinho Neto, the death of Habat Chitepo, the death of uh, Orva Tambo, the death of Marie Mignere, the death of uh, America Cabral, the death of John Garan, 
never stop us from moving forward. So therefore, the challenge is that those who are, who, who are living continue the struggle. This is what I wrote in the book. And I wrote that His Excellency Magufuli was such a dedicated servant of the people of Tanzania, the people of East Africa, and the people of Africa. It is such a great loss. But it should be a challenge because I could see how sad the people of Tanzania were. The ones who have been flocking in the stadium to 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 to, to pay to, to 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 say goodbye uh, to to him. So therefore, it is the challenge of those who are alive to continue the struggle, as we did in the past. Because when we lost our comrades, we never gave up, and because we never gave up, we succeeded. And even this time, we shall succeed. May the Almighty God rest his soul in eternal peace. I extend condolences to the Tanzanians, to the East Africans, to the Africans, to CCM, and to the family of His Excellency Magufuli. Thank you so much. Yo Erika Guta Museveni wa Uganda Hileo alipo tembelea ubalozi wa Tanzania pale Kampala nchini Uganda kutoa eh, pole na salamu zake za rambi rambi kwa Tanzania kufuatia msiba mzito wa Dr. John Magufuli na nikimlukuka uli yake ni kwamba mapambano yanapaswa kuendelea